Hashtag give Captain America a boyfriend. What the? What's up, people? So today, the Twitter world exploded with people using this hashtag, Give Captain America Boyfriend. Apparently, some Marvel fans are taking to Twitter to express their interest in giving Captain America a boyfriend, saying that he already has a boyfriend in Bucky Barnes, you know, the Winter Soldier, uh, the character that he goes through the entire Captain America Civil War movie trying to save. You know, they, they assume this is because they have a relationship instead of the fact that they're actually just friends. Apparently a man can't have an on-screen relationship with another man without assuming that those two men are sexually involved. And I don't understand why they want to use Captain America for this. Like, why can't they find another character to try to make gay? Why do they have to try to make already established characters gay? Like, it's already pretty evident that Captain America isn't gay. He shows interest in a uh, character in the first Captain America movie. I can't remember what her name is, but he shows interest in a woman in the first Captain America movie. And then all of a sudden, they act like just because he, you know, has tried to save Bucky for the past two Captain America movies that apparently that makes him gay now. Apparently, he can't just be really trying to save his friend. Apparently, two men can't be friends on film. If you, got, if you are going to have a gay character they need to be established as that from the beginning captain america was never a gay character and he hasn't been there is no gay marvel character that i, th that I can think of and then the thing about it is we've come to the point in our lives where you know you can't even speak out against this or you're homophobic everybody that opens their mouth and say that this is a horrible idea people are going to say they're homophobic and they have something against gay people but in fact this is just this is just one of those things where you do not do this you don't see us trying to take any gay shit and make it straight hashtag give captain america a boyfriend how is that trending how marvel or disney is not going to take that kind of calculated risk at alienating you know, their audience. Look, I guarantee you that that movie is going to bomb at the box office. It's going to bomb on DVD. It's going to bomb on TV. It's going to bomb everywhere. It will get no support. And regardless of what people think, like I said, I'm not saying that, you know, it's anything wrong with being gay. I support everybody that is gay 100%. If you're gay, be that. But once you try to take, you know, these characters and you try to make them gay, you're creating this problem. If you want characters and you want movies, why not build your own character? Build a gay superhero. Start, start a gay superhero franchise, you know? If you start, a, start a comic book where all the superheroes are homosexual. Start that. Let's see where that goes. If you can take off and sell some comic books, if you can sell a cartoon, if you can sell, you know, a pilot, then maybe, you know, you can talk and say that, you know, you can say that you want a gay superhero on film and in theaters because at this moment right now, even though we have made big steps forward when it comes to accepting people for who they are, that is never going to happen. And I'm not going to try to make it happen regardless of how much I accept them. I'm still, I would never stand behind something like that because it's moronic. It has nothing to do with whether I hate gay people or whether I hate, you know, whatever. Because it's not a thing of hate. It's a thing of making sense. And this just doesn't make any sense. It's the dumbest thing I've seen trending in a long time. But that's it. This is Scotty TV. I live.